Good afternoon YouTube. In today's video I'm going to show you how to wrap the sling around the front sight post on your Kalashnikov variant rifle. This is to help keep the sling like steady and keep it from flopping around like when you're carrying your rifle or if you want to like say store it on your gun rack or whatever. The rifle you see in front of you is my 2013 Century Arms Wasser 1063 with Russian furniture on it, of course. Of course, it's mismatched, but that's only temporarily. The handguards are plum polymer, probably Soviet 80s production from an AK-74. The pistol grip is a plum Ivzhesk pistol grip, and the stock is just one of the laminate, like, Arsenal refurb replacement AKM stocks. And, of course, I do have some other Russian goodies, such as a cleaning rod, cleaning kit, and an 800mm rear sight leaf from a Type 3 AK-47 and I also do have a Russian slant break on this one. So, back to the topic at hand, let's get started. First, I will show you that the weapon is clear, magazine is empty, and chamber is clear. So, first of all, you're going to want to flip the rifle on the left side, which typically on your on your Kalashnikov variants, that's where the sling, that's where the sling is for the most part. But of course, it's different if you have something like, say, an AK with one of the Romanian or East German style folders, which the sling will be right here, or if you got like one with a triangle stock, like you see on an AKS 74 or whatever, in which the sling swivel will be on the other side. In this particular one, I just have the standard loop on the handguard retainer and the sling swivel on the side of the stock which is correct for it's correct for AK-74s and very late production AKMs although most of the time with AKMs the sling swivel is down here on the bottom anyways what you're going to want to do is you're gonna just adjust the sling and and loosely like not really loosely excuse that word being interjected but you're going to want to adjust it and and like get it to match up with the front sight post and then push it over the front sight post. Since I store this rifle with the sling wrapped around the front sight, I already have marks right here which is about, oh, halfway down the sling. While I am, while I am adjusting the sling, I will say that this will work with pretty much your typical Kalashnik Kalashnikov sling like this. The folded over metal with the three rivets. can also work with dual hook slings for like RPK, PKM, etc. And it will also work with the older style Russian slings that have the leather tab on them like you typically see on milled receiver AK-47s. So anyways, now your sling is adjusted to where you think it'll fit the best. You want to match it up to the front sight like this, which in my case is pretty much perfect. Now the name of the game is just taking it and pushing it over the front sight post, or not. Yeah, front sight post, front sight block, whatever you want to call it. Anyways, you can just push it over like this. Sorry, this is proving to be quite difficult, but there we go push it over like this and as you can see it's relatively snug against the side of the rifle and the best part don't know how well you'll be able to see that but you can actually aim down the front sights although this is good for like carrying the rifle and storing it I don't recommend it for shooting because if so, as some of you guys might know on the AKM the ports on, between the gas block and the gas tube are located right here on both the right side and the left side why I do not recommend shooting your rifle with with the sling wrapped around the front sight like this is because because like hot gases and, and whatever comes out of Kalashnikov gas tube I don't know Slav magic or whatever the fuck <laughs> but anyways what comes out of the gas tube it will burn your sling unfortunately I have done that with a mustard colored dual hook RPK sling that I have which, I guess if you're into the whole BFPU thing, like some people are, Battlefield Pickup, you would probably, you probably could be okay with doing that. 
However, myself as a recreational shooter, I would prefer to avoid that, although I did have that one slip up. And as, as I've said, you can still aim down the sights and you can still, like, use the rifle functionally and all that. How do I do that? Anyways, YouTube, this was my tutorial on how to wrap a sling around the front sight on your AK variant.